All right, tonight we're going to make um, stuffed flounder. And we're going to use crab meat as our stuffing. And as you can see there. Flounder? So first we have our crab meat in our bowl. And we're using a pound of, or actually we're using um, one cup of that. But we kinda, we're doubling it, so, so actually we just add some more crab meat. So we're doing one cup of crab meat. We're starting in the bowl. Then we're doing um, one and a half teaspoons of chopped green pepper. We add a little extra. And then we're using, um, we're actually going to add a little bit of onion in ours too. So I'd say that's probably about a quarter of a cup yeah. of onion. And they're also going to use, if you have dry mustard, use a um, quarter teaspoon of dry mustard. But all you have is regular mustard, which you can substitute just fine. And it's basically just a squirt. Is it new? It's new. Sorry. <laughs> so we got our new mustard. We should take the cap off of it. Like I said, if you have dry mustard, you can use a quarter teaspoon of that. You can use one squirt of Yeah, if you have regular, just use a squirt of regular yellow mustard. And I'm also going to use do a uh, quarter teaspoon of Worcestershire sauce. A splash of that. <laughs> Quite a few splashes. Same thing with salt. We're going to do a quarter teaspoon of salt. Give yourself a couple of good shakes. And an eighth of a teaspoon of pepper. I don't know, what is that, like two flakes? <laughs> I like some pepper. And yeah, actually, the next one you can either use an eighth of a teaspoon of red pepper again. It's probably about three or four flakes. Or you can use uh, a quarter teaspoon of Old Bay. Like and I like words. Old Bay, so I'm going to go ahead and use the Old Bay. And it has, it has some kick to it anyways. But if you want some extra kick, add some red pepper. And then we have to use three saltine crackers crushed. And that's going to be our, uh, our, basically our little breading. <laughs> Yeah, kind of just hold everything together along with the egg. Let me say, if you don't have, if you don't have the crackers, you can use breadcrumbs. Or... or if you had to, you can take a piece of bread and put it in the toaster and <laughs> crunch it up. All right, then we're gonna use our egg. Just one egg. And then we're gonna use six te teaspoons of mayonnaise. Or that's three tablespoons, or two tablespoons. And three teaspoons a tablespoon? Yeah. So there you go. How about that much? Mm, that's plenty. And then we're going to use some melted butter, which we've got to put in there next. So when we come back, we're going to add our melted butter, but you can go ahead and put your paprika in now. A quarter teaspoon of that. Or a little bit more. A little extra for a garnish look <laughs> so when we come back we're going to add our butter and uh, go ahead and stuff our meat <laughs> 